Well, hello there. No matter when, where, how you're watching this. Good morning, good day, good evening. This is Nogan, your friendly mumbling average gamer. Welcome back to Surround Dad. Yes, I am quite addicted to this game lately. And I was originally planned to continue my stream tomorrow, but um, just so happened I was talking to my well tank friend. He is uh, probably had some time to check out this game with me. And so here I am and in prompto stream of Surrounded. Anywho, since last stream, I actually went to the safe zone to sell off all the um, junk items that I gathered last time. And now I am ready for more adventure. Uh, before that, should we come visit our <laughs> our uh, little treasure trove and see what new day and new loots it uh, brought for us? So I did upgrade my camp a little bit. Uh, I put a well in here, so now I can fill up my bottle once the well actually collected enough water. Um, I can actually just drink from it too, so that's perfect. So I, you know, every every time when I'm at my camp, I don't have to uh, worry about being thirsty. Uh, as mentioned last time, um, saying a camp in uh, in surround that so far um, doesn't do a lot in terms of. Um, actually building up defense because there's no zombie attack or you know a camp basically currently doesn't get attacked by anything or anyone so the defense that we set up are basically for show at this point uh, but you know I uh, picked up these uh, concrete barriers so I as well place them yeah as mentioned I need to give um, developer some feedback <laughs> uh, on discord hopefully uh, you uh, work on probably adding implementing some sort of um, random attacks to camps so um, I have a little bit more ideas on that too but that would make uh, setting up defense on the camp more interesting and has some you know real impact and can test out our or mine skill or uh, idea in terms of how to set up a proper defense. Anywho, so let's do the trick of removing all these item that block item respawn from nearby containers. So this should be it. Let's see. Let's have fun picking locks again. The famous Skyrim or Fallout mini game. Yeah, nope. All right. I am impressed by my own lock picking skill. <laughs> Only one lock picks. I didn't even break it, so I actually technically didn't use up any uh, lock picks. So, ah, buildable blocking. All right, something else is still blocking it. What will it be? What will it be? Is it uh, the well? Oh crap, I can't remove the well. All right, can it be the barrier? Let's see. I hope it's not the well. Yeah, that's another weird thing. Once I place a well, I cannot move it. I cannot pick it up. <laughs> oh no. I may have screwed up my little, you know, infinite loot scheme. Oh no, no, it works. It works. All right. Another uh, legendary Barrett 50 cal Mac. That's awesome. All right. Oop, what is this? Looks like the med medical crate hasn't been loaded yet. All right. 
Some antibiotics. Good. And free 250 XP. Never say no to that. And what do we got here? Another backpack. Awesome. Alright, some bullet casing and ammo is always welcome. Never say no to more bullets. Alright, what do we got here? Oh. Alright, last box. Last locker. Oh, well, finally a big backpack. That's a good upgrade. Just put the whole thing in here. Alright, look at that. Oh, and this is actually a better body armor than what I have. Civilian body armor. Sweet. Alright. I love my little infinite loot scheme. Alright, let's play all these guys back. Alright, so let's go visit Wilson one more time. Sell off some of the junks. Alright. Just getting my evil people. Oh, it's there. Can I turn on the siren? No, just horn. <laughs> be fun if I can turn on the siren. I would be an instant zombie magnet. Alright, I've picked up some free scrap metal. And that sh shambler shouldn't be a problem. Just two. All right, I take one out and then I can melee the other. One. Oh, he already saw me. Down you go! Alright, you got nothing for me. How disappointing. Oh, uh, well, some tape, better than nothing. Compass is okay in terms of selling price. Still there. What's up, Wilson? Got more stuff for you. Oh yeah, uh, <laughs> these are all the uh, collectible um, camp decoration items that I've found so far. A cowgirl. All these uh, Funko Pop bobbleheads. A Viking. <laughs> How expensive! These two Vikings. A samurai also. Check this out. All right. And a neon cactus. <laughs> uh, I need to find a good place for um, a decent camp. And I'll set this out uh, for fun. So, okay, so my 
school book back backpack look at kitty backpack is where I'm storing all my decoration items or camp items is this where I'm storing all my guns yeah I think so now okay so I have a lot of um, 762 compensator all right in light of that I should oh I already did sell that all right did I I did okay good um what else do I have here? Bunch of I've picked up two Barat 50 Cal Max already. So hopefully I'll actually pick up the gun at some point. Uh actually does she have any ammo for me all right not really okay so we are all the way up north right now and let's go check out Elwood I think we are ready for a little bit of a exploration in a full-size town Right, think so. I don't have a lot of bullets, so that's why it's also good to have a second um, primary weapons and ready. All right, so oops. <laughs> Ambulance, uh, good, nice and big, decent storage but definitely not so maneuverable. So I'll be driving down this row and at the second corner, make a right. And I'm gonna avoid the main row. I'll drive parallel to it, just to avoid all these little zombies. So this is the first corner. Is it clear? Yep. Oh! <laughs> right, when I say yup, I ran over a zombie. No, it's not clear. Alright, there. Wait, is that a zombie or is it uh... I... Okay, those guys are not gonna follow me, right? Okay. So, I don't know if those are zombies or... I think they're zombies, so why they would be firing at me. Unless they are friendly survivors. These are all zombies. Uh, they are not responding to me yet. So. Alright. I think I'm gonna start here. Oh! Oh crap. Alright, crap, crap, crap. One down. Where's the other one? Did I run it? Did I run it over? Alright, you know what? I should eat. No can open. Oh my god! <laughs> Shit! Did I just sell my can opener by mistake? I think I did. <laughs> Gosh darn it. I don't have can openers. Well, I'm gonna find one soon. I do have some cooked meat, so I'm gonna eat that instead. And drink some water. All right, I think the other one I just kill with my ambulance. Where is he? Yep, he's dead. <laughs> Alright, Elwood, here I come. Alright, so do you have like a 
tourist center that I'm gonna visit. You know, pick up some brochures, see what are the main attractions of your town. Ah, oh, can opener, perfect. Thank you so much. The game hurt me. Cry of agony. When I realized I saw my one and only can opener. All right, so um, where was I? Here, yes. That's where my tools are. So I <laughs> try to be um, organized here. Turn back. I am not turning back. I've never been to this town actually, even in my other playthrough. So, so let's start from the uh, peripheral. I heard some footsteps. Yep, there's a zombie coming. And that shambler. There's no one behind him or her. Uh, I love those lamps, as I mentioned. Those uh, perma light. All right, first steps. Uh. Oh, it's not dead yet. Come on. All right, here we go. <laughs> More can openers. Good. Zombies like to carry can openers. Alright. Uh, there are a couple over there. Alright, shall I go check out this first house? Nah, yeah, let me take care of those two first. Just in case they uh, wander in as I'm looting. Looting would definitely take up all my attention. You know how much I love loot. Alright, my trusty axe is doing well so far. Check out this first house. Stock here. What you got for me? Fishing pole. I do have a fish. I do have a fishing pole. More free XP. Awesome. Just drink it. Alright, all this cheap stuff that only worth five bucks, so I'm just gonna drop off. I'm not even hoarder like me need to be a little bit efficient this time. Uh, Molotov. Do I have Molotov? Yes, I do. Oh, I have something. I thought I heard footsteps. Nope. Just me being paranoid. It's good to be uh, a little bit paranoid in a uh, in a world of, full of zombies. Right. Wait, where's my... Oh, here. Okay. I wish there's a... Like, auto... 
organize <laughs> key. Uh, it's gonna be low priority for the developer, as I mentioned. This, I think there's only is a one-man shop, so I'd rather him work on something else first. All right, can openers. Now I have more than I need. So, more of the story. Don't be afraid if you accidentally sell your can opener. There will be a lot more in your role of adventure. All right, All right. only the good stuff. Well, I say good. Something worth more than twenty-five bucks per. Per, um, per slot I think that's a good baseline in terms of what I should pick up alright first house cleared I don't think I can uh. ouch ouch Uh, undead fireman killed by my fireman's axe is only appropriate. But oh, sun is coming up. So this second house is apparently uh, all boarded up. Can't even get it. Ah, oh, more zombies. this house. What do you got for me here? So let's work my way down this row of houses. Oops. Anyone out here? Nope. Alright this one looks okay there's something. Oh nice another uh, decoration. Night. <laughs> oh, cool! I'm doing pretty well in terms of finding these uh, decoration collectibles so far in this playthrough. Awesome! Right. Oh, this town is pretty big. Oops. beans. Now I can finally eat those beans. Just eat it. I'll drop the can. I'll be littering. So. Sorry. At least no one's gonna give me a ticket. Some energy drink. This. Ooh. Cool, nice bag. A small survival backpack. All right, keep on keeping on. The god, the god of hoard, god of hoarder. <laughs> That's me. Anyone out here? Oh, it's actually quite safe. It's all closed up. Alright. I'm getting a lot of cloths. That's not a bad thing. Can always uh, make more bandages. Oh, more. F <laughs> Looks like I'm getting f better at fishing. <laughs> By just reading books in this game. Bandages are good. 
I didn't pick up the toilet paper. I may regret it later. Oh. Hello. Have you been waiting for me? Sorry to keep you waiting. Okay, he's on the garage too. Alright, let's grab them all for now. Oh, this one, this guy definitely pack up all the clothes they need to leave this place. But the car is still here, so I guess it's too late. One more here actually got looks like a stuck between the car and the garage. Alright. I just freed you for eternity of getting stuck. You should thank me. Oh wait, this alright, this house is also unreachable. You sneaky, sneaky. Didn't know you were here the whole time. Whoa, okay. On clothes. Think back here. lot all right I finished the first low row of houses this I guess is officially second row ish food in there all right some more batteries that's awesome oh another book all right next more well, it's waiting for me oh hunting hatchet almost oh, more uh, gas cans all right never say no to gas okay Oh, a lot of fights so far, a lot of looting and uh, hoarding. I'm gonna try out this hunting hatchet. 328. I'm gonna swing a little bit faster, I think. I don't know if I like it more. Let's see. Yeah, it doesn't do as much damage. Uh, 
Oh, he's on zone. Come on. You're a noob tourist. On the second row of houses, more zombies over there. All right, um, I think the uh, hunting hatch is not bad so far. Yeah, it doesn't hit us. Hard, but at least I can. Uh, ouch! <laughs> Swing faster. Oh boy. Sneaky bastard. Alright. And quiet down. Medical crate. Nice. Big medical kit. Is good. Alright, um, going this way. I'm glad they're coming at me one, one by one. Oh, there's one guy inside. Can I kill him through the wall? <laughs> Guess I can. Right, is this one of those locked doors? Yep, it is locked. Let's test off my lock picking skill again. Nope. Uh, here? No, I'm gonna break this lock pick. Nope. So this way. This is a, this is a novice lock. <laughs> Oh, come on! Jeez! Oh, uh, I... I'm losing my touch. Damn it. There's another door in the other. Ah! Ah! What am I doing? No! 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 Wasted some bullets too. No, 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 no. Oh, now I wake up the neighborhood. That's not good. Ah, uh, ah, uh, no. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Shut. They heard the gunshot. Crap, everybody's here now. No, no, no. Uh. What happened when I fat finger and uh, switch to guns by mistake? Jeez, I took some radiation damage too. Well, quite literally live and learn. I wasted a couple of uh, bullets too. Which gun did I fat finger to? Oh man, my AK. I wasted bullets on uh, 762. I don't have a lot of 762. <laughs> Noob. I mean, how, how did I even fat finger? the uh the rifle like that all right what else uh 
Uh, picked up a few nine mils. Bullets instead. Wait, is that? Uh, yeah, there's another zombie there. There's a well. Awesome. Wait, uh, there are more than one zombie over there. Alright. Shall I use gun? I should use gun, but I should use uh, something with a silencer. Can I hop onto... <laughs> Shoot. Two zombies here. Die too. Alright. Don't underestimate the uh, silly slow zombies. Wait, are wait, are they the two that were uh, the few that were sitting over there standing over that opening before? Oh man. I was thinking I'm gonna ambush them and I got ambushed by them instead. Noob. Alright, since I'm here, I as well look for some. Uh, no gas. Never mind. Uh, another crawling one. Crawlers. Crawlers are annoying. They, since they're crawling and then they just um, pushing up against your leg, so if you're standing and try to melee them, a lot of time you can't actually hit them. So that's why I have to crouch down. Right, can I pick this lock safely? Yeah, maybe I'll sneak. Okay, this is standard lock. Supposedly harder than the last lock I was picking. Let's see if it's going to actually turn out to be easier. Okay. Uh, nope. No! I'm losing my touch. Come on. Oh my god. So close. The more. Oh no. Oh, finally. You bet I got some good stuff for me. Let me close the door behind me first. Medical crates, painkillers. Yes, good. What you got? Uh, some zeros. All right, I'll just eat the zeros. And ammo! 45 ACP, 556. Oh, good. Some 556. I can use more 556. And 762. Military crates. Oh, yes! Another hot beacon. <laughs> Police shirt. Hmm. Right, helmet. That's not bad, but I have a better one now. Oh, a 9mm drum magazine, finally. Nice. Oh, I can set spawn point in here too. Oops. Huh. Cool. <laughs> can keep coming back and uh, loot technically yes a good m4 nice another akm but it's damaged so we're not gonna use it but i can probably use the mac 
that extra magazine. And oh, there's a briefcase here. Key cards, awesome. Airfield key card, FOB Bravo, and private bunker. Sweet. Where's my um, key card briefcase? All right, let's break into this locker and see what we got here. M4 CQB. I think it's close quarter battle. It's better for close range combat for sure, but I probably prefer the regular M4. It doesn't hurt to hold on to it. Okay, oh. Oh, not done yet. There's another locker. Whoa, check this out. NP7 is rare too. Nice. It's nice, nice, nice. MP7 use. 45 ACP and it's considered a sidearm. That's pretty cool. That's a pretty cool sidearm for sure. So absolutely definitely keeping it once I have enough ammo and attachments. That's a pretty good haul. Got the MP7. That's awesome. And a uh, good M4. It's not enough ammo, that's all. Well and a whole bunch of key cards too. I almost want to just set spawn point here. <laughs> but I don't know, if I spawn back here, uh they gonna these guys gonna spawn back too. I mean I can just place a fire campfire here. I'll probably uh alright let me just clear out the houses surrounding this house. Then I can set a campfire. Because if I set up the campfire right away, I can loot the other houses around. Another box. Oh my goodness. A lot of free XP. Never say no to free XP. Okay. How about this? It's chopper. Oh, chopper doesn't have anything for me to loot. Right, I'm gonna set up a campfire. Place a campfire. And I am going to set up some lights here so it's easier for me to find this house later. Where are my lamps? Little lamps. Here we go. Put one right here. Oh, might as well put two. Uh, make sure they are turned on. Put one in the back. find my way home I right, fill up all my bottles I don't think I have any bottles to fill uh, all right let's continue on the second row oh this town is humongous it's gonna take me forever to uh, to clear it and and loot everything sell everything might have to make a few trips well the thing is every time when I reload it's gonna reset too <laughs> you know what <laughs> maybe I should make that camp my one well, my permanent camp the house it may make sense because you know, if I do die I screw up like before and even worse be good that I actually spawn back here and continue. All right. Which way am I going again? I'm confused. Wait, this is. 
Oh, I'm still going to in this direction. Oh. <laughs> oh, that guy is stuck there. Wait, can I? Yes. Let me help you get out of your miserable condition. Alright, hit. I hear footsteps. Someone's coming. Footsteps. Is that my own footsteps? Yep. Yeah. There are definitely more zombies. Ouch. Really? The one that's stuck in the wall is actually uh, most deadly. Alright, here we go. Jeez, it's getting dark too. dark yeah definitely not gonna finish this whole town today I may have to come back so but it also means it's gonna it's gonna reset right so I may have to clear the old town again so unless I place a lot of uh, buildable stuff around to stop them from spawning Oh no, I may have to do that. Alright, so so I finished first and second row. But I am definitely not done yet. So how am I gonna do this? So okay that is the house. The the house that's lit up is where all the goodies are. Which I can set as a spawn point. Doesn't matter, I mean, spawn point is important when I die. I truly. I don't think I'm gonna die. I mean, if based on the current difficulty of this town. But the only thing is, uh, it's big and annoying. I don't wanna clear the places that I've cleared already every time when I come here. So, you know what, maybe I should set a whole bunch of campfires in the middle of the row. Hopefully that will cover two rows, I mean uh, with a radius that cover two rows so I can set up a, a few down this row that should at least stop the zombies from respawning for the first two rows. So ideally this way I don't have to clear this entire place every time when I come back. Alright, let's make some more fire. Ah, uh, campfire. How many can I make? 
Only two. Crap. That's not enough. Craft item drop. Um, put it right here. Is it far enough? Uh, I also don't want to overlap them. That would be a waste. How about right here? top of the of the car <laughs> yep I can all right so hopefully it works Well, it works like this then yeah I probably need to make some a few runs to the shop also to sell some some of the loots that I've gathered so far and we equip myself all right oh one thing I can do is probably build something else like a crafting table here instead. Right, those also block spawning. So I, then I can move the fire, campfire outside. Easier for me to craft stuff here too, if I want. Yeah, I can make a crafting bench here. Alright. Uh, where should I put this? No, just put it here for now. And I mean, at least set off, set up a couple of lamps. One at least. Just kind of dark in here. Where should I put it? Nice. So now I can place it somewhere else. Maybe. Right here. Set up a tent here so I can store some stuff if I want. Or can I place it here? <sighs> this tent is too big. I have a smaller tent, right? Yep. Oh, this one. Uh, wait, am I stuck inside my tent? <laughs> I'm stuck. <laughs> uh, geez. How did that happen? I just try this again. All right, better. Oh. All right, that is better. All 
I hope that works. So I think next I am going to the shop because it's getting dark anyways. Go to the shop, sell off some of the junks, and come back for second round. But I think I'm gonna continue that tomorrow. And so yeah, I <laughs> really like this game. I know uh, I didn't have a lot of uh, massive epic fight today. Um, I did almost screw up a little bit there when I accidentally fired my gun and I tracked a whole bunch of zombies. So that's a, that's a lesson learned. <laughs> I don't even know if I actually learned the lesson because I, I still don't remember how I fat fingered and fired my gun in the first place. And oh by the way my guns also have a uh, compensator muscle attachment so it makes the gun even more loud so instead of using a silencer I haven't found a silencer yet so uh, to be stealthy I probably need a silencer instead that would help a lot more in uh, that kind of situation um, but so far I mean this town is humongous uh, looks like I mean I've only explored the first two row of houses and only find some decent loot. So and I think I'm probably just I just cover I don't know one fifth of the whole town. So um, gonna make a few more runs for sure. Um, the second probably gonna be faster because now I know what I'm expecting. Um, but. Anywho, um, I think that's it for this stream, uh, ladies and gents, thanks so much again for stopping by and it's, it's my privilege to be able to share one of my favorite games with you guys. I hope to see you soon, well, tomorrow. Uh, until then, stay safe and healthy, be kind to each other, I'll see you next time.